we're asked to simplify the given fractions. For these two examples, it's helpful to remember that a fraction bar means division. So in general, if we have a over b, this is equal to a divided by b. So because our first fraction is 10 tenths, 10 tenths is equal to 10 divided by 10, which equals 1. So the given fraction simplifies to 1. Let's also think about this conceptually, though. 10 tenths means we have 10 1 tenths. So to model this, if we define this rectangle as one whole, because the denominator is 10, we cut or partition the rectangle into 10 equal parts or pieces, as we see here. And then because the numerator is 10, we want all 10 parts or pieces, which gives us one whole. Again, 10 tenths equals 10 1 tenths, which equals one whole. Next, we have seven ones, or seven over one. And again, because the fraction bar means division, this is equal to seven divided by one, which equals seven. So the given fraction simplifies to seven. Thinking about this conceptually, seven ones means we have seven one holes. So if we define this rectangle as one whole, we would not cut or partition it because the denominator is one, and because the numerator is seven, we want seven of these one holes, which gives us seven. I hope you found this helpful.